Hey class, it's Ms. Garcia. Um, I wanted to go ahead and make a quick video showing you how to work on your memory book, which will be our last project for the year. So I have pulled up on my screen the instructions that I sent out to each of you that tells you what we're gonna be doing and how to access your memory books. So if you look here, I want you guys to have fun with this assignment. First and foremost, this is our last like assignment for the year. Make it fun, make it nice, because again, I'm gonna be printing this out and giving it to you and your parents at our graduation. So first things first, I'm gonna read the instructions really quickly with you guys just so you know what we're doing. First thing you wanna do to find your memory book is to go to your class folder by clicking one of these two links below. So I'm gonna go ahead and, for example, for this video, I'm gonna to go to Miss Cherry's homeroom. So what you'll do if you're in Miss Cherry's homeroom is you'll click Miss Cherry's homeroom class folder. I'm just easily gonna click it and it's gonna take me straight to that folder. So as you see here, there's two folders that I created for you guys. One says class photos, and that has, as you'll see, all the class photos that I've collected on my phone from this year, and I went ahead and I put them in here for you guys. Okay, use this folder, come here constantly to see if there's a picture that you can use in your memory book. And I'll make a video separately on how to put those pictures into your book. Okay, I'm gonna come back to the folders. Okay, so that's one, class photos. You'll find all the photos you need for your book there. The most important one is the one that says student memory books. Double click this to get inside that folder. And here you'll see I created a folder for each of you. Inside this folder has your memory book. So I'm gonna go ahead and start, pick one at random. I'm gonna go with Kaneria in the center. Kaneria will click her name and then here she'll see her memory book. Okay, go ahead and click this to get into your memory book. And here you'll see it is a PowerPoint, like slides. But in these slides, you can go in and edit and type in them, and I'll be able to see all the changes that you make. So for example, here's Canaria's book. I went ahead and filled in some of the slides already for you guys, like the one with your name is already filled out, the one with the class roster is already filled out. But go through and fill out any of the other ones that are blank. So for example, you'll see all the pages here on the side. I'm gonna go ahead and click the next one. So you'll go through and you'll answer all of these and you'll fill out all the pages in your memory book. To do that, very simply, you just click where it says type your answer here. So this memory book was created by, and then Kaneria will come in here and type her name. Kaneria Deuce. And then she'll answer all of these. Okay, so that's pretty much how it works. You just type right into the PowerPoint and it automatically saves it. You'll see right here, last edit was made seconds ago. You don't even have to save it. It'll save it for you every couple seconds. There are a couple slides that I do want to point out. For example, there are some where you'll see where it says to input an image. I will go ahead and make a separate video with how to put in pictures. But other than that, this is pretty much all you need. You remember because all right here, there's a lot of really cool slides that I put in here. So go ahead and go through all of them. You'll have all week to finish this and it has to be done. Let me come back to my instructions. It has to be done by Friday. That way I can go ahead and print it and have it ready for you guys for graduation. On your instructions, you'll also see some other really cool links. So I went ahead and put all the links to find your memory books here and then all the links to find your folders here. So everything you need is inside this document, okay? Get creative, add color, draw, put in your own photos. I'm really excited to see what you guys all make. If you have any questions, reach out to me, okay, guys? Have fun with this, and I'll see you guys soon.